my mouth. Everybody will cry. Go meet us here. Oh, Jesus. Papa. It's okay. Papa. I don't want anything. Up till January this year, I never worked with Junior Pope, and I was wondering. Aside water movement, we go to very risky places, and um, they don't provide security. We go to thick bushes to shoot. Junior Pope died many years ago. Junior Pope was killed by our producers. You know, Junior Pope died a few days ago. A lot of people have come out to speak. But I want you guys to pay good attention to what this man of God said that is sparking reactions on social media. We'll be right back to do some messages to it. Do you know Pope, yeah. Pope to be one guy for the Nigeria movie industry where they do very well. Mm -hmm. But I want to send a message to you for cross-check a papa inside. Because the darkness on Junior Pope not take time out. Plus in family or oh, one day bad news go forth for Naja, they go regret. Because the gods Junior from the Pope. father's side, they make hot for it back. Mm. The gods from the father's side, they are throwing accident his way in the spiritual world. When now, since Junior Pope died, a lot of people have come out to share their own opinion. A lot of people have come out to to speak about the mystery, the negligence, Hi, the yes. recklessness behind his death. But in all of this, the one that speak. broke my heart and got my attention is this particular actor. What he media said in this particular video. I want you guys to pay good attention to it. We'll be right back to do But this time around, I need to speak. I need to talk. Hi, friends. I hardly speak. I hardly come to social media to talk. But this time around, I need to speak. I need to talk. Because what killed Junior Pope is not even the boat capsized or something. No. That is not the ontological of his death. Junior Pope died many years ago. Junior Pope was killed by our producers. Yes, the major producers killed Junior Pope. The cartel, they killed Junior Pope. I am saying this because nobody is feeding me and nobody can feed me. I am already made and I am made for life. I am bigger than all of them. Bigger, far bigger than all of them. People that knows me will testify to that. Our producers killed Gino Pope. How did they kill him? Let me tell you. Listen. When I came to Nollywood, when I saw Gino Pope, the way people outside see him is not the way he is in Nollywood. Gino Pope is struggling to survive. Yes. Our producers, they blacklisted him and so many others. Junior Pope don't see work in Asaba. He hustled outside Enugu Owere, Lagos, to work, to put food on his table. Most people, if not for E-Money, E-Money bought him his car. Junior Pope was driving one Jalopi car like that when I came to Asaba. E-Money bought him a car, a good car, the one that he's using now for, for, for the past four years now, if I'm not mistaken. Junior Pope is a hustler. Everybody shouting, uh, Adam Maluk, Adam Maluk, Adam Maluk killed Junior Pope. How? Are you, people, are you people giving him job? Nobody's giving him job. That's why he's going to Anam to shoot. Because if Junior Pope is busy, like every other artist here in Asaba, what will he be doing in Anam? Even just like me, I can't go to Anam for one billion. Why? How? Even with the life jacket. Yes, I can't. How much do you have to pay me to go to Anam? If, I, if I'm to go to Anam now, I'll go with divers, so many things. With... So the person that even gave him a job tried. It's not easy. How many producers are giving that guy a job? Go and check. You guys know big producers in Asaba. Go and check their page. You hardly see Junior Pope. Put me anywhere. 
if not for content creating facebook that's how junior poop was able to build a house after 30 years in the industry go and check from facebook Junior you know Pope is star in the eyes of the world, but inside Nollywood, he's nobody. His fee is like upcomers' fee. Others are collecting one million, one point, but Junior you know Pope is collecting peanut. Only one guy that I know that is pushing him back to back without rest. Even when other people are fighting him, he will write script. They will tell him that we can't use Junior you know Pope. He will insist. Ike Chukumweke. Ike Bobo, God bless you. God bless you. You are the only person that is worthy to say rest in peace. Other people are just creating content. Put me anywhere. That's the truth. Bitter truth. I'm saying this because nobody is feeding me. Nollywood cannot even feed me. Yes, I am made before I came to Nollywood. I'm already made before I came to Nollywood. Nollywood, the whole Nollywood, I'm bigger than the whole Nollywood. Juke apart. That's why I'm saying this. Nobody can say it because they believe that if I say this one, they will not give me a job tomorrow. Fuck you with your job. To hell with you with your job. How much are you going to pay me? How much do you have to pay me? The fame I'm looking for, I've, I've, I've already gotten it. I've already gotten it. People snap with me anywhere I go. Yes. What else? How much are you going to pay me? You people killed, killed Junior Pope. You people kill Junior Pope because if Junior Pope is seeing himself as a star, he cannot, can never enter a boat without life jacket. He doesn't know his value. People out there see him as a big star, but he, he, inside us, yeah, he's a nobody. Let's, that's the truth. That's the fact. Yes, that's the truth. And many people are still going through this fucking process now. Even most of the elders, people, 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 people see them as stars, but they are nobody. They are collecting peanuts. Most big stars, like not like Junior Poop, go and check their 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 their, 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 their diet. Go and check their this thing. They don't have chance from now to June next year. They are fully booked. Junior Poop is going to Anam because of what? No job for him no good job for him no good pay for him that's the truth yes somebody you know pope is a big star he have stayed in hollywood for many years e-money bought him a car e-money bought him a car facebook made him build his house finished it last year after 30 years in hollywood because you people blacklisted him now you are posting him and cry whereas you killed him what kind of life is this you people are there creating content up and down what did you do for him when he was alive nothing nothing you did nothing for him. Now you're crying. You know, poor, you know, poor. I said the only person I know that pushed him is Ike Bobo, Ike Chumweke. Go and check. You will never see Junior you know, Pope worked with any big stars in Asaba. People like uh, people like uh, uh, Fred Glonard. You can never see him work with them because big producers can never pay them. It's not possible. You people killed him. Now you people are crying. Crying for what? Is Junior Pope busy and he's going to Anam to shoot for what? So that is it. Junior Pope was frustrated. He doesn't know his value. That's why he was able to enter that boat without life jacket. Yes. He doesn't want to lose that job. The job is so important to him. That was why he died. Please, our producers, it's high time you people turn a new leaf, the ones that still have conscience. And thank you, Ike Bobo, for pushing him as much as you can as a director and scriptwriter. And thank you, Imoni, for always helping him whenever he runs to you because you always help him. He said it to me someday that Imoni always help him 
I am not afraid of losing jobs. No. And I'm not afraid of losing my life. Because all of us will die someday. Death is inevitable. No matter how strong you are, you must die. Nobody will live here forever. Nobody. Yes. That is it. Gino Pope died out of frustration. He is struggling to meet up with his mates. When his mates are shooting here, he's running up and down to make sure he's shooting. Not like he's not good. Just that he, he was blacklisted. So that is it. That's what killed Gino Pope. 98% of our producers contributed to his death. Quote me anywhere. You can come to Asaba and verify. Or call one or two people you know in the industry. They will tell you. But nobody can say this outside me. Nobody. They don't burn you well. If you know, if you talk, if that they collect you spiritually or they collect you physically. <laughs> but who I be now? I be that a gamma lizard that was transbound trans cool, trans amadi, trans mama, trans papa by the council of the chief faces at area de hama. Venue V, moment M, occasion O, placement P, before the chief Valentino, AD Nanok, party 2, blessing to my coconut and China me some power seas. Power seas to try and see more here and still remember myself. So nobody try and see my calability and remain the same. I can vibrate from this time until infinity. I can say anything from now till infinity without any kung fu kung fu or OBT boom. Or OBT boom. <laughs> Fire me and I will water you. Junior Pope, rest in peace, my brother. You tried. You struggled. Nollywood rejected you. You still make it. It's not easy. It's not easy. You tried. After listening to this guy, for me personally, I don't really know how to explain it. It happened to be that not only would there is no love amongst them. You see a lot of actors who were once a big actors in the Nigerian Hollywood space automatically don't see them acting anymore. You wonder why what is going on, and you a lot of them stop acting. And go for normal hustling. Why not only would like this guy said blacklist a lot of people? You know, there are a lot of celebrities we saw that okay, because they are acting, we thought they are they are rich until they have situations about the payment. You see some people crying out on social media looking for donation. Then you see ah, these people we thought maybe comparing them, we thought they are like uh, Macadonga or Dangote because we see them most of them in series of movie now. We never knew that most of them are getting peanuts. Or like the Gino Pope, until his death, I thought maybe minimal if they want to book him is going to be like 2.5 million, 1.5 million. I never knew it got as peanuts as 250,000, 400,000, or 300,000, depending on the budget of the movie. Because the biggest Nollywood uh, producer has selected fewer people because. If you ask them to call this person, they will refuse. No, I don't want to call this person because maybe they, they believe it might charge more than they are expecting. Or because this actor said, oh, the money you are paying me is not big enough. They will just totally blank the person out of movie list. You should do be Mike. So be Mike is a big actor, not because money would make him rich because he found another way to become rich you can't just call if it was Zubi Michael, i don't think this lady particularly the producer would call Zubi Michael and book just a flying boat without a life jacket well uh, i just posted uh, pictures of junior pope and i um, i listened to frank tana when he talked about how he was uh, frustrated. I agree with him to a reasonable extent because uh, in this our job, you can surely be frustrated. But I make bold to say that uh, when I was producing, I was uh, the biggest producer in worry. And the two biggest movies I've ever produced in my life, um, I used Junior Poe for them. One is the vengeance of bullet. 
that won five awards and uh, the other one is flames of love far back 2010 then jazz of bullet cost me eight million and the flames of love 13 million so you can imagine how big those movies were and i was really hoping that junior pope would blow from those two movies and since then since i came to uh, asaba um since 2018 up to January this year, I never worked with Junior Pope and I was wondering. And I kept asking him why we've not worked. We just laugh. But in January, God bless Percy Adoki, who now paired us in a job at Agbo. I played uh, the role of uh, a Don and uh, Junior Pope was my hitman. It was a very fine movie that is here to be released. So Frank, um, I'm one of those that actually featured uh, Junior Pope and um, it's so, so unfortunate. I've bared my mind in uh, our group, AMP group, Delta State, about my take over others. And I predicted that if producers don't change, they will witness more because they don't take safety seriously. Aside water movement, we go to very risky places and um, they don't provide security. We go to thick bushes to shoot. They don't provide security. Uh, but I'm careful as a person because the last one we shot where I need to carry heavy weight, <laughs> I dodged it. So I advise uh, fellow artists, do the beat you can do if you know it's too risky don't do it. But I hope that um, the producers will learn from this and put unnecessary precautions in place anytime they want to shoot. Um, I don't want to wash our dirty linen in public, but we need to do a lot in Hollywood. We need to do a lot. Um, Junior Pope has sacrificed, the ultimate sacrifice. And I hope that uh, we'll make changes. On my part as uh, national patron of AGN, I will work with my chairman and also the president who will make some suggestions to the president. And we need to enforce those things that uh, Emeka Rolas, um, our president, has put in place because the producers are still flouting them they still work on Sundays when we are supposed to rest. They still work us late into the night without caring for the uh, safety of the cast and crew. All that needs to change. Some of us need to take the bull by the horn and tell them the truth. No matter whose ox is God, you know, like Tana came out to speak, I think we all need to speak up. If they don't want to give us jobs again, we all retire to our homes and um, farm. <laughs> yes, we all can farm, you know, but the truth must be told. Junior Pope, rest in peace. So for me, I don't really have much to say. What do you guys think about the pastors who said that, oh, it is spiritual attack. This video was done last year, not this year. The pastor literally called Junior Pop out that there is a spiritual attack that if he don't take care of it, he will die by accident. And unfortunately, just as the pastor prophesied, it happened. Maybe people just felt like, hey, this is one of the first prophets. This is one of the prophecies that normally comes untrue and all of that. That's why people neglect things like this. Now it happened. The deal has been done. There's no mercy after death. Even if there's mercy, it is no longer needed. So what do you guys think? I'm going to be leaving this video here. Give us your opinion, what you think about what this guy said, the author, how he makes breakdown, how Junior Pope literally begged for rules before they could give him any rule, how Nollywood producer blacklisted him. I don't know what he did. I don't know his offense. What are the things he did wrong? How the other guy, one particular guy, have been the one calling him for a movie. A lot of people just say, I've been seeing him movie. How many big budget movie? Did you see him? Not all movies you watch on YouTube are very big budget movies. There are some movies they just have to select you. You will take 100,000 be no. If, if you say you don't want to, they leave you. 
Except they know you are a big star. Most of these will be make uh, you saw actress Destiny Tuko. All these one are producing movies by their self because they have money. If this guy, particularly Junior Pope, has his own money to be producing his own movie, I don't think that oh it will happen this way. Anyway, the death that will take somebody's life, no matter how extremely careful you are, it will still happen, except God intervene on your case. We pray that similar things like this will never occur in the space of Nollywood. But Nollywood themselves need to sanitize their own personal space because the death, the way they are dying or timely is no longer funny. Well, we're going to be leaving this video here. What are your thoughts about this old video, the pastors and the other Nollywood guy, what they said? Please comment it in the comment section. Remember, we love you, but God loves you more. If you love us, the only way you can show your love to us is to like our video, share this video to all your platform, comment your thoughts about this particular video you just watched. And if you love our video, please don't forget to subscribe. If you do, turn on your notification bell so that you wouldn't miss out any of our future uploads. Until we meet again, peace out.